Bridge Enhanced ACL Repair, also called bear surgery, is not the first technique that has been used to try to repair a torn ACL. However, this is the latest development and has shown some early results that have been promising. The bare surgical technique was developed to address the problem of healing within the environment of the synovial fluid around the knee joint. By creating a micro-environment within the center of the knee, where the ACL is located, the researchers have tried to create a space where healing can occur. The way the bear surgery works is to use a temporary suture device in the location of a normal ACL to hold the alignment of the knee joint in proper position while the ligament heals. Surgeons then implant a synthetic matrix around the ends of the torn ACL. Within this matrix, stem cells are injected in order to stimulate the healing process. Potential advantages of ACL repair surgery promoted by the surgeons developing these techniques include. 1. Less pain because of no need to obtain the graft tissue. 2. No large incisions, the procedure is done entirely arthroscopically. 3. Retains native ACL tissue. The investigators readily admit that the long-term results of this surgical procedure are not well understood. It is not known if this procedure is better or worse than ACL reconstruction. There have been some promising early results for bridge-enhanced ACL repair surgery. Researchers have published their results of slightly less than 100 patients who have had this surgical procedure and showed results that are comparable to the early results after ACL reconstruction surgery. MRI findings show that these patients do heal their ACL, and the early results show that these patients have knees that are stable and allow them to return to sports activities. The results do not show that this procedure is better, or even as good, as ACL reconstruction in the long term. In addition, while there are hopes that people who undergo ACL repair may not have a high risk of developing knee arthritis, this has not been shown in the data. Like many medical advancements, it often takes years or even decades to determine if a new treatment is as effective, better or worse than a standard treatment. That said, this is an encouraging step and creating a lot of interest in whether or not we can find a way for ACL injuries to heal.